Hello and welcome to this installment of First Amendment Rights. Today I am paying a visit to the Emanuel Lutheran Church in the city of Orange, California. I'll be conducting a First Amendment audit here from the sidewalk today to see if the folks inside will hopefully honor and respect my First Amendment right, freedom of the press, to take photo and video from a publicly accessible area. So stick around and we'll see how things turn out today. This church is on the corner of Chapman Avenue and Pine here in Orange, California. It's cool. Check out this plaque on the front here. Nineteen twenty three. Wow. Almost a hundred years old. I got someone coming over here. Just checking in. Uh, are you interested in the church ar architecture? Oh, just taking pictures. Okay, I'm one of the elders here. I'm just curious why people are taking pictures while we're worshiping. Oh, is there um, a problem with that? No, I'm just asking oh, okay. if I can uh, see why you're taking pictures. Oh, you can ask, of course, yeah. Okay, are you yeah. willing to share? Uh, no, I'm not. Okay, we have a constitutional right to do what you're doing. Yes, I do. You can see why this would weird people out as we're worshiping Jesus. There's somebody randomly taking video of our church. Not necessarily. Okay. Why would it be seem weird? You're sending off. God bless you. Why would it be okay. seem weird? Oh, that's odd. All right, you have a good day, too. Well, at least he's aware that I have a constitutional right to do this. But they still think it's weird. Uh, oh, he's taking my picture now. I got a cam back. Oh, I don't care to discuss what I'm doing right now. What's that? I don't care to discuss it. Can you stay back, please? Thank you. Have a good day.
curious what you what you were filming uh just filming it, well did you want to come inside the church and come not, to the not service? at the moment no i'm good right now thank you though for the invite okay are you just uh, filming for any particular reason or i don't care to disclose that right now okay just make sure you respect people's privacy we have some food inside if you'd also like to come in and get a donut or something can i ask what you mean by privacy just respect people going to church. They might be a little uncomfortable if somebody's filming them and they're they're just trying okay, to. Okay. Well, I mean, there is no privacy in public. You're aware of that, right? It would be a kind thing to do to respect their privacy when they come to church. It would be nice. Well, they need to create their own privacy though if they want to. Well, okay. yeah. Okay, that's yeah, that's fine. Because anything I can see from the sidewalk, I can obviously film. Sure. Sure. Yeah. But, but maybe just be considerate of people that are coming to church, okay? That would be a nice I'll be thing. considerate, but I'll politely decline. Thank you. called creating privacy. There you go folks, that's how you create your own privacy. Anything I can see out here, I can film. You're acting weird. Acting weird? How am I acting weird? Uh, you're masked outdoors. Well, there's still COVID going around still. Leaving church. There's still you're COVID going around. It's weird to wear a mask during a pandemic. Wearing a mask outdoors, filming people as they're leaving churches. Well, if you're if you're approaching me unmasked, you know, 
I'm going to protect myself, so I don't know if you're vaccinated or not, so it's only fair. Is that a question? Huh? Is that a question? Is what a question? Is that a private medical question about myself, whether I'm vaccinated or not? I didn't ask you if you are. I said okay. I don't know if you are. Okay. Yeah. And I, I really don't care. That's why I prefer to take precautions for myself. Right. Yeah. So film away. It's free in America. It is. That's the beauty of it, right? I think it's a beautiful thing that we're all exercising our First Amendment today. Okay, you're not you're not harassing anybody here at the church, right? Making them feel unsafe. In what manner? Just following them around, pointing a camera. I'm, at I'm them. just I'm just taking pictures of everything I can see. Right. Yeah. There are laws in this country that make people able to feel safe and not harassed. Well, so please. You're in the way of my shot right now. I'm trying to get a picture of the well, stained glass. Thank you. Okay, but just please be considerate. As I've said before, please be respectful and please be kind. If I hear that anybody is afraid or frightened of you, I'm going to have to call the police. I haven't initiated contact with anybody. Okay, but following them around. Well, you just did. You just asked me a question as I was standing here. Huh? Well, you, you came. You initiated it with me first, so. But please, Thirty minutes please. ago, I had a conversation with you. You just initiated a conversation. You're but, acting weird. We're uh, co conscious of this, and we're paying attention to what's I'm going just, on. I'm just gathering content for a story right okay, now. But we're concerned that you're stalking people here at the church. No, I have no ill will or nefarious intent. Okay, but yeah, no, we that. know that when you're behaving this way. Taking photos? You're recording everything, taking photos. Everything that I, I can see. I think it would correct. be a good idea to contact the police just to make sure everybody's safe. Yeah, I mean, that's, okay. if that's what you got to do. Go no, right I, ahead. I think that's fine. Okay. okay. Yeah. I'm not saying you've done anything wrong, but for our own safety and for the safety of the... We have children here. We have people of course, here. yeah. Safety is important. I fully agree. Okay. Yeah. Okay. suspicious individual uh, who's filming and recording us as we're leading church at a manual Lutheran church in Orange, California. Could you send an officer What's out? The, the address? Pine, Cross Street, or Pine and Chapman. What's the name of the church? Emmanuel Lutheran Church. Okay, and what does this person look like? Uh, wearing, a, looks like a mini skirt or a blue jean dress. And a long, I think it's a blouse, you know, uh, whatever type of hat is, I don't know how to describe it. Okay, and is that male or female? Uh, appears to be male, but don't know. Okay, and if you want to go on the Asian or Hispanic? Uh, appears uh, Caucasian. Okay, and that's what it's for me, so a blue jean dress? Uh, skirt, I think it's called, yeah. And what color shirt? Uh, blue. And I don't know if there's anything wrong, but just making a, lot, making a lot of people feel uncomfortable here and filming the actions and calling the record. Not a member of our church. Okay, and about how tall is he? Uh, five and ten. What color hair? Appears blonde and a ponytail. Correct. Filming the interior of our church. Uh, asked him why, why he's here. Not a real clear response, a little bit combative, making some members uncomfortable. Okay. And so, he, so how is he able to film inside if he's standing on the sidewalk? The doors, the door close to the doors yeah, doors were open. Gotcha. And your name? Lucas. And your office? It's Gerald. F I T Z. I don't know who you okay. are, and I'm not worried about anything, but I don't know who you are. Okay, if you can just walk away from him, sir, we'll have an officer go and look with you. Yeah, I'm on church property, so I'm fine. Okay. All right, and did you want the officer to contact you as well? Please. Okay, and where will you be at? Uh, I'll be on the church property. Okay, all right, um, we'll send an officer. Thank you. All right, thank you.
Okay. Yep, better just for you to take off right now. Disperse, please. Take off? Thank you. Why would I do that? If you called the police, I'm not going to take off. <laughs> I'm the one that made the call. Good morning. What's going on? Uh, I have a gentleman who's filming uh, the parishioners leaving the church coming in. Trying to make a little contact while I'm here with the pastor's uh, uh, pod. I have several members of the church. I actually have my number I gave uh, I know they on the phone. I know they know First time it's happened. So I guess we, they haven't been, uh, he hasn't been on our property yet, so I don't think we can do a trespass. Yeah, so point. it's a yeah, it's part public yeah. sidewalk. Correct. Um, so if he wants to we just there, have to do exactly what he's doing. That's yeah, so weird and uncomfortable. They could have been sent by somebody though there, so we can verify if they're talking about it. So he can't impede traffic. So the things he can't do, can't impede traffic. Okay. Could he put people on the internet? Or phone numbers it's on the public internet. Public. He's in pub Everyone's in public view on public property. There's nothing. Okay. He can, as long as he stays right there. And can he film into the church? He's in public view. Okay. So anything that's closed is out of public view. Yeah. Right. If, he, if he goes into your church, you don't want him in your church. You call us. But, but, but yeah. yeah. He, uh, yeah well, why are you now? And if there's a perception of a harass going on, how do you call us? We have to have a victim. Somebody has to feel like they've been harassed. You, you just had a question or. Um, say that I don't uh, it's, like this. It's still not enough. It's like, yeah, we feel uncomfortable. I totally understand, but it's not like a, it's not enough to. Uh, it doesn't meet it. Yeah, it doesn't yeah. rise to the level. Okay. It's All just right. weird and annoying and frustrating, and yeah. makes you wonder why somebody would do something like this. You know what I mean? Sure. And I, I get that you feel uncomfortable for your safety because people typically do stuff plan attacks and stuff like that. People do this exact thing. Right. So we will keep an eye on this uh, this property for this kind of activity. Can we do a report with Nick? Can we ask for a name? Uh, do at least a report? No, th there would be no report because there's, no there's nothing to report. So, okay. yeah. Well, I know there's no crime, but could we at least uh, start any sort of it's, a... So there's already a paper trail that's been documented that we were called here for this week. Okay. But we and can't this. identify the person. There's no crime. Okay, do, so... Do you want to give me your name, date of birth, or... Driver's license? Oh, I don't care to give that information. Okay. Yeah. So no. that's all we can do. Could I follow the person not harassing, not saying a word, and if his license plate is in a parking lot, that's also public. I don't do anything with it. It's not harassing. I, I would caution you from doing that because, again, nothing that he's done has risen to the level of crime. Don't put yourself in a position where something that you do will. He's taking the license plate. Uh, there's nothing we can do with that. Okay. No, but is that a crime, taking the license plate? Do you write down what it so if I were to follow him, not say anything, I would say I would strongly advise against it, but it, this is annoying. There's nothing you can do about it. Ignore it. Yeah. For now. Until it rises to where we can get involved, ignore it. Completely yeah. ignore it. I advise you to uh, everyone inside that, hey, ignore him. Let it go. It's, it's not worth your time. Because what he wants is this, right? He wants. He's he guessing. Wants. Sure. What I'm guessing is what he wants is us to get involved. And then make some money off of something happening that we do. That's my guess. So be nice, be friendly, think it's weird. Ignore it. Ignore it. Yeah. Ignore it. Okay. And as long as it doesn't rise to the level of blocking prisoners' access, if there's 13 next Thursday, a hundred followers, as long as there's not an impediment or a worship, it's going to be annoying. What do you mean by like impeding that? Like well, if there's like prisoners are trying to leave today. The, this person was standing right in front of them, and they were a little. He can be on the sidewalk. Yeah, yeah. impeding. They can. They have the ability to walk around him. It's okay. not going to be impeding. Okay. It's not going to be a crime. So what this is is the more that you ignore this, the less you'll show up. Sure. Yeah. We just we wanted to check and just see, make sure we were doing everything on the up and up. Absolutely. I get it. We get it. It's weird. And and just to ease your concern, I'll I'll edit out your phone number. I have no intention of sharing. Yeah, I'm, I don't. I don't believe in sharing private information like that. So you haven't identified okay. yourself. Well, you, know that. Mask. 
you have my phone. Well, again, I said there's a pandemic going on, and I just choose to be cautious. Yeah. You're going to go in circles with people like this. Okay. So there's no point. Yeah. Okay. So. Yeah, it's all good. Say what you want, but thank you for coming. We just wanted to make sure that we knew what to do. Thank you. Thank you, officers. Thank you for serving the community. Stay safe out there. Have a good day. Can I get a name and badge number, sir? What's that, brother? Can I get a name and badge number? Yeah, Officer Channel, 1635. 1635, all right. Thank you for your professionalism. Stay safe. Well, guys, that's going to do it for me here at the Emanuel Lutheran Church and School. Uh, we had some uh, parishioners come out and... Uh, and upon Orange Police, two units showed up, two officers showed up, and they explained to them the uh, law that uh, I'm not in violation of any law, standing on a sidewalk, taking photo and video, as uncomfortable as some people might feel by a camera. So uh, go ahead and like, uh, subscribe to First Amendment Rights on YouTube. You can also find us on uh, Facebook at Public Photography is Not a Crime. I thank you again for joining. Take care, and we'll see you on the next video. Bye, everybody.